The need is definitely there. Thousands line up early in the morning for a chance to get free medical care. We told you yesterday organizers were expecting it and it sure happened. Check out this line. Yeah, it is the largest free medical dental and vision care clinic Detroit's ever seen. It's called the Motor City Medical Mission, offering free help to anyone for almost anything. Nick Monticelli was there. Good evening. Things are kind of wrapping down here inside of Kobo. They've got two more days left. That is okay. But I want you to take a look at all of this. This is just the dental section in here. There are many, many more. This is the most popular one because that's what most people need. However, I can guarantee you all the things they're offering, you probably wouldn't even think that they'd give out. This, this, is, this is really nice. It is not very often you'll see a group of people standing in line outside for hours on end and they're happy to be there. A lot of people can't afford dental insurance, period. And the line that formed outside of Kobo in the middle of the night proved that. The need for free medical, dental, and vision care is great. What's wrong with your teeth? <laughs> need to get a few of them snatched out because they will not fall off themselves. Normally, dragging Chioma Smith out of bed early is like pulling teeth. But for some reason, not when she actually needs some teeth pulled out. Her mom, Sherry, and brother, Raziel, were here by 5.30 a.m. She needs dental work. Um, it totals over $1,000 right now. And so being self-employed, that's just not something we can afford. Inside the Motor City Medical Mission, thousands of volunteers and even more patients fill a Cobo Hall. I wanted to check your vision. I don't think you're having vision issues, but I just wanted to check just to make sure. Sherry says the process was simple, and what's surprising to most is everything else that's offered. They'll be able to get free legal um, consultations. Uh, there's clothing uh, that they'll be able to avail themselves to, um, massages, haircuts. Uh, we have a lot of surprises for everyone. I'm telling you, we're going to take very good care of our Detroit residents. Heck, they can even make crowns on the spot. Rah! All right. And despite the free roaming, ferocious tiger, many came thankful for the help. It makes you feel slightly helpless, but it's good to see that good people like doctors and nurses and dentists want to help with things like that. That Cobo Hall, Nick Monticelli, Local 4. And the Motor City Medical Mission runs tomorrow from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and then again on Friday from 8 a.m. until noon.